darling. Come in. Thank you. Ugh. You saw Dr. Bulger, didn't I you? Did. Yeah. yeah. And she's put on here, we need to repeat your liver function. This is the best one. That's good. Oh, yeah. It's a whopper. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> as long as you leave me some. Has nobody seen this yet? Has anyone no. seen it? No. No. It, it doesn't bother me, except yeah. if I touch it there, which is the point of, end, end, you know, contact mm -hmm. with the floor. <laughs> yeah. I don't check the faces, but no. I'd be inclined to put you in to see the emergency doctor this morning. Maybe you'd better check it I out. Would. Yeah. I would. I would prefer to, yeah, okay. have the doctor have a look. OK. Well, I fell and fell in my Yes. Yeah. Um, everybody says I have to have it checked out. To when did you fall? On Saturday. Saturday. What happened? Well, I was coming down the escalator yes. in the shop. Yes. Yes. Um, with a trolley to yes. turn it round. Of course, the escalator doesn't stop. Of course. It keeps going. Yeah. <laughs> Taking me with oh, it. Oh, bless you. And I couldn't stop myself. Is it, it painful? It's only if I touch it. It's not that painful now. Yeah. You know, the pain died yeah. down. But the, I saw a chiropractor yeah. yesterday because I see them for yeah. my arthritis. And then I saw the nurse this morning yeah. to give my blood sample and she said, I think you should have. Oh, all right. So they enough. both said, yeah, have it have a little Because yeah. you're on aspirin, aren't you? Yeah, that's why I'm that all sore? black and blue. Ah, uh, yes. That bit sore there. Yeah. So there's no bleeding uh, from the nose or ears? Or no, anything, no. no. Good. Ow. See, that, I think it, the cheekbone, yeah. actually, is probably bruised. You know, something it is, like that. It's all bruised around here. Yeah. Bless no, you. just in the hole. <laughs> And it'll take ages to get better. A few weeks, I yeah. Know it mm. You didn't lose consciousness when you fell. Oh, no, no. Other side. OK, good. I think it's just badly bruised. You think so? Yeah, I don't think you've broken anything. No, that's what But because you're on aspirin, it, it yeah. does make you bruise more bruise easily. easily. Yeah. yeah. I thought it might be oozy completely. Oh, I know, you poor thing. I think I had them bad enough off. to start with. It will get better. We've just got to be patient. Eventually, yes. Anyway, I'm sorry to take up your no, time, no, not but it wasn't all. my fault. Better oh, safe than sorry, though, eh? Well, I suppose so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, thank you very much. That's all right. Yeah. Take um, the lift, OK? OK. Well, <laughs> Don't want you me. falling down the stairs now. <laughs> Bye. 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 Hello, Dr. Morris. Thanks for waiting. How can I help? I've got two things uh -huh. in my foot. I've used the ward cream as yeah. well. Yeah, okay. And yes. This one is quite yeah. painful yeah. as well. And uh -huh. the same as yeah. this one. Okay. The treatment for this is to buy something called duct tape. Or duct tape. And you put it on, cut a little piece off, put it over it, leave it on, and usually within two to three weeks they go away. And, it, and it's twice as good as the stuff in the chemist or freezing or anything else. And I can find it on... So, OK, good question. So a hardware store, places like, you know, B&Q, Wix, those sorts of places. You need a smear. You know, you know a smear? A you need, yeah, that's what it's saying, you need a smear. Oh, it's been five years now. Well, it's every three years you need it. Is it? Yeah. So if you make it point the way out, that'd be great. For that. Oh. OK. Sorry. It's best to have one, though. Thank you very much. Okay. Bye bye. Here we come. Here we come. No, John, today. Have you got your new teeth? Yes. God, they're much better than the old ones. I know they are. <laughs> you look great. Are you happy? Yes. I think they're great. Oh, that's very Thank kind you. of you. That's very kind of you. Let me get this chair out. I've known Peggy for probably 17 years. As soon as I started at the practice, I uh, got to meet her. She suffers badly from quite extreme osteoarthritis, uh, which has affected most of her joints over the years, uh, particularly her back. And when I started doing acupuncture as a treatment, uh, then she seemed to be a perfect client for this uh, type of treatment. Before I start sticking me, yeah. this cough 
Ja. Er flyen en hårdt? Ja. How long for? Well, it's just about cooling off now. Okay. When when do you mean by that? Do you, do you mean for like for the last four, day, okay. four days? Right. And I, I haven't been able to do a lot with it. And you can't remember doing anything to it though. No. Oh, definitely not. No. I've been doing a lot of gardening. I'm just wondering where I. You didn't feel a pull or a snap or anything like that. <laughs> So I've been using acupuncture now for about 15 years. I attended a course um, and was a little skeptical after coming out, but I gradually in introduced it to my surgeries and over the years have found that, you know, 70 to 80% of people get some effect from uh, the treatment that we give them. If you can cut down on medication, if you can uh, reduce their pain levels, then um, I feel that it's a successful uh, treatment. God, the hair's been done as well, hasn't it? Yes. Very noticeable today, aren't you, David? Mm. Mm. It's not routinely used under the NHS unless you go into a specialist pain clinic or physiotherapist uh, normally. In fact, there's only, I think there's only two of us in Slough who offer acupuncture as a service, uh, and we do it off our own bat. Um, OK, let's have a look. OK, so nice and relaxed, just let everything flop. See, that hurts. That really hurts. So all over if I yes. do that, yeah. Yes. Any specific point or not? Uh, all Just that. all of it. All that. All of it, all the way up and down. Yes. Oh, yes. Okay, that's your muscle, isn't it? That's. Is it? Yeah. I want to talk about my toes. That one there now. Yep. The that's coming over here. The overriding one. Yeah. And this one is coming over. Okay. Like that. So <clears> do I have to phone up and speak to him, or do you have to? I'd have to. Me? I'd have to refer you. Yeah. I mean, the problem with that one is that you've still got a bunion of sorts here. Do you know what well, I mean? I haven't had that done, exactly. So it's in that direction. So this is a reasonably straight toe, yeah. but it's this, this one's po popping underneath it, yeah. whereas that is just the most disastrous-looking toe I've ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> well, it takes a 90-degree turn, doesn't it, yeah, it there? Does. So, yeah, it's, yeah. so that's very different. So that would yeah. be to do something with that joint. Yeah. Um, well, I'm quite happy to have it done. Whereas that one would be... I would be I would te be tempted not to do anything with that. Okay. Okay, because I think that would involve having to do this whole foot. Yeah, and I don't want that done before I go That's away. A, but that I think probably needs to. Is it causing pain? Yes, and especially when I've got shoes, and I can't back to square one again. I can't yeah. get my proper shoes on. All right, Madame. What have we got? These sticking out here, 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 here. So I'll send that five to six weeks. Yeah, I will. So we'll send that off to you and um, we'll get It'll you back in right again. The... Yeah. Look, let me help you. Well, what are you doing? Yeah. You haven't had a gin today, have you already? No. no. Okay. Okay then, Dave. Have a lovely holiday. <laughs> I will. Um, look after yourself over there, please. I will.